the Roomba, the iPhone, the Chia Pet, all life-changing inventions. However, the misuse of our patent system may keep the next big idea from becoming a reality. Inventing a better patent system, that's today's BFD. Last year, Apple and Google spent more on patent litigation than they did on research and development. Why? It turns out there are entire businesses that exist just to sue software companies for patent infringement. It's called patent trolling, and it needs to stop. It keeps good ideas from ever reaching the market, and it makes the products that do make it out more expensive. There is still no legal agreement on the definition of a software patent. For example, US patent law excludes abstract ideas from being patented, which software code arguably falls under. The line between a patentable software product and the unpatentable code that makes it work is blurry, and in those murky legal waters, there's room to sue. That's where patent trolls come in. They buy up vaguely worded technical patents, stuff like representation of assets on portable devices, application rights enabling, and claim they're being infringed on by every piece of software since 2005. It doesn't mean any of these will be valid when tested in court, but the defendants will still have to lawyer up and prove it. Since the trolls pick rich targets, most of the time they'll just get paid to go away instead. Recently, a group called Arendi SARL, yes, they do sound like a James Bond era terrorist cell, sued Apple blanketly. What does that mean? It means they sued everything, as in claim by claim, iPhone by iPod. According to their lawyers, Apple is infringing on everything, everywhere. It's a huge waste of everybody's time and money, keeping the next cool invention out of your hands. So, what can be done? Where are the heroes to fight the patent trolls? For a start, you are. A grassroots organization called the Coalition for Patent Fairness is trying to rally as many voices as they can. You can visit patentfairness.org for more information. The other hero? Our own government. I am a tote shocked on this one, but it's true. In 2012, we actually celebrated the one-year anniversary of the America Invents Act. It essentially streamlines the process of getting a new patent through the system, allowing more ideas to come through the marketplace. It also adds more satellite offices to the United States Patent and Trademark Office so they can finally get through those backlogs of application and process cases. I hear we might even get an iPhone 5.14 out of it. Again, learn more at the Coalition for Patent Fairness's website, patentfairness.org. Thanks for watching. I'm Lilan Bowden for BFD. Subscribe, it's patent free. <laughs>